Our next award goes to Don Roth, CEO of Amplibox Sound Systems in Northbrook. After Don purchased uh, Amplibox Sound System in 1995, he set out to re-energize it by emphasizing new products, cutting edge technology, and an emphasis on customer relations. The results speak for themselves. Sales increased from $2.8 million in 2007 to $5.2 million in 2010. <coughs> Excuse me. The company manufactures and markets a wide range of products used in public speaking, entertainment, and education, including wired and non-wired lecterns, megaphones, portable PA systems, and multimedia presentation workstations. One creative endeavor in particular has generated national attention a specially designed pink lectern that was used at breast cancer fundraisers and activities by the American Cancer Society, hospitals, and the U.S. Army. Quote, our products are all about helping people to be heard, and I'm always inspired to see these committed individuals using our podiums as they get their message out. Congratulations, Don. Manufacturing in America is not dead. <laughs> we have proven this at Amplibox. With mundane technology, we design, engineer, and manufacture auto electronics. And we put them in PAs and lecterns and a whole variety of uh, final products. We have net added seven people this year. We have a new software engineer a new manufacturing engineer, a new product development engineer, and a young lady who's here with us today, Sherry Edecker, who is reorganizing our organization for the next generation. Part of what we have done is we, we adjust, we modify, we take products and refresh them every year, and that's helped us sustain this growth. And I love the word that Tom used, sustainable, and every day, probably the youngest entrepreneur in this audience. It's 71. I get up, fire every day. Ask <laughs> that <laughs> But I am deeply grateful for the honor. I'm deeply grateful for our team that continues to adjust and grow. We just, uh, just got a patent on a new uh, wireless frequency that's way up in the gigahertz that will continue to enable us to grow. Uh, the last thing that I want to mention is the Pink Podium uh, program that we did under Cause Marketing. We've got several programs where we've supported the Susan G. Komen Foundation. We have donated over 150 of these pink lecterns that you may see in different programs that they have. We're very proud of that. That's part of our culture is to give that back to where we came from. <clears throat>